good morning you guys well good afternoon um welcome to another vlog y'all Casey is trying to get in his car seat so i am getting ready to head to a birthday party y'all i have so much going on today but let me go ahead and show you guys what went on earlier this morning okay you guys so i'm coming on camera looking real crazy you guys i actually took my wig off eight o'clock this morning because i had a hair cut appointment because I was going to rock my real hair, but then we were going to the beach, then we were going to the water park, now we're going next week. So I'm all over the place. So I'm just sitting here, you guys, at my laptop, um, checking out my emails, and especially my work email, you guys. So I actually forgot to tell you guys in the last vlog that we are doing school virtually here in Alabama for the first nine weeks. So I'll be teaching Kaysen at home, and I'll also be teaching at home. Y'all, I am so stressed out right now, it's crazy because they're not even giving us, they're not being very specific when it comes to what we're supposed to be doing virtually. And it's just really stressing me out. Like, I'm just like, I don't even know at this point. I have no clue. And then we have to be on the camera, on Zoom, Google Meet, whatever you choose to use, at least eight hours or seven and a half hours a day. Um, kind of like how school is, 7.30 to 2.30 or 2.45, whatever. Well, y'all, I'm over here looking at this stuff like this is absolutely crazy. Like, I just got off the phone with one of my um, co-workers, you guys, and I think everybody's just confused. I know Monday I'm going to the school to go pick up my um, technology because they always give us a computer and a laptop every school year. And I guess I'll be saying bye to my old classroom. So, um, I'll be doing that Monday. And by the way, you guys, today is... Um, today is saturday but y'all i like this is giving me anxiety really really bad I'm sorry if you guys hear like the noise in the background i actually get my grass cut but um i'm about to get my butt up so i can do my hair i need to go get lunch and then i have a business call to get on at three o'clock that i'll probably tell you guys a little bit more about um in this vlog but um let me go ahead and get up and get my life together. I did not want to start the vlog like this. Um, so yeah, let's carry on. <laughs> so yeah, you guys, we are headed to a birthday party. Um, I am like a whole hour late, you guys, because I had to get cute. Like, y'all saw how I was just looking right, sis. I told you to get cute. He did. Kason told me to get cute. He was like, mama, do your makeup and get cute. So I was like, okay, I'm finna get cute. So anyway, you want a piece of gun, baby? Push it in. Hold on, it's probably not the right seatbelt. Here, you want a piece of gum? Rub the lotion in on your face. So yeah, y'all, we headed to um birthday party. So let me get cute. Like it's 351. Um, I don't have a whole lot to do today, but I have been busy, you guys, and right now, like I'm kind of in between conference calls. So I'm like trying to vlog, trying to go to a birthday party, trying to have a conference call, like I'm just all over the place, sis. Like, I need to get it together. And I'm trying to hurry up and get to the party because my nephew's there and my sister's like, hurry up and get there. So, that's what we're doing, you guys. Stay in the left two lanes. So. Stay in the left two lanes. You mocking the GPS? And I just wanted to show you guys my hair. Like, I just have a ponytail, but I just have it, like, flipped to the back. In three quarters of a mile. Turn left onto Biltmore Avenue. Waits for the GPS to stop. So yeah, I just have this um, ponytail and I actually just put on this curly unit, you guys. Pulled a few pieces of that um, out and then I did my little baby hairs and did a little quick look. And sis is ready. I did a red lip because I had red in this shirt. Sis is um, ready. So yeah, sis I'm is ready, sis. Boy, y'all, I cannot with Kaysa. Uh, are you gonna tell them what's up to the vlog? I'm well, they can't see you. He's moved to the other side, y'all. So he doesn't sit behind me anymore. He just made that decision himself today. All right, so I'm gonna um, I'm gonna talk to y'all. Stay in, a in the left. You gonna say hey to the vlog? Hey to the vlog. Look at him. He all wet. Are you having fun? Yes. All right. You ready to get out the car, Kason? Come on, baby. We need to put your swim clothes on. Ready? All right, you guys, so I made it home. I am dressing everything. I re my lipstick. I'm like, you know what? Let's just go ahead and go with the red. 
You guys, I have been doing this little uh, thing right here using my mini ring light and my phone to kind of take pictures and then I'll Snapchat um, the video and then I'll screenshot which pictures I like. So yeah, that's what um, I was just doing. Um, I hope y'all like it. Like, I like it. I like this whole um, wet look. Oh, I need to do my edges on that side again. But yeah, this is pretty much the look, you guys. I just like to listen to music when I'm um, getting ready. And this is what I'm wearing, you guys. Like, I'm going to, like, an outdoor event. It's supposed to be real chill, real cool, you know. So, this is just a, um, a one-piece, cute little romper. And then I have on my, um, my denim vans. And that's pretty much the look. And then I just have on, um, gold jewelry and everything like that. So, let me go ahead and do my edges so I can get ready to go. <laughs> My babies so i am getting ready to get ready for my friend's surprise cocktail party today is her birthday um i'm trying to decide between these two outfits i have these um american eagle um high-waisted skinny jeans and then i have this cute top that i got from boohoo and then i was going to pair it with these rose gold clear heels and then i also have this dress but i think the dress may be a little bit much I'm not sure you guys I've never really been to a cocktail party and we're supposed to bring like our favorite um wine so I'm also going to do that but I think I'm leaning um more towards this one let me go ahead and get myself together do my hair and then I'll talk to you guys in a minute good morning you guys so today is Sunday happy Sunday you guys I am in good spirit I am in a good mood I'm actually um heading to my friend's um, cocktail party today um, she's turning 25 and y'all my heart is beating I'm so nervous because I really think her boyfriend is gonna propose to her I'm nervous like I'm getting proposed to but it just makes me so happy you guys like I'm so excited for her she is just doing the damn thing like she is off the chain so y'all I just finished actually watching TD Jakes it was about faith I feel like that message was really meant for me you guys I'll be sure to leave it in my um, description bar if I can remember so you guys can check it out but it was today's Sunday service y'all I am just feeling motivated I'm feeling um very um um my faith is growing you guys I'm trying to steer clear of fear and we'll talk more about that y'all but I'm actually trying to hurry up I just wanted to come on here to say hey to y'all I'm going to show you guys my outfit and as you guys can see right here I was getting ready to um take some pictures before I walk out the door I don't want to be late it starts at 2 and it is Alexa what time is it it's 1.35. Okay, it's 1.35, so I have about five minutes to take some pictures, and then I got to go, sis. So, um, yeah, that's pretty much what I'm doing today, you guys. I'm so nervous. I'm so excited for her because I really do think he's going to propose to her, y'all. But I'll come back, and I'll let y'all know. So, that's pretty much what I'm doing. Oh, real quick, and let me show you guys my outfit. So, this is what I'm wearing. White skinny jeans are from American Eagle, so obviously I went with the first outfit. This beautiful top is from Boohoo. I had to put a safety pin in it right here, you guys, because it was just too much titties. I was like, sheesh, like my boobs are all over the place. All right, thick girl. Yes, ma'am. And then I got on these super bad heels, you guys. These are like some clear rose gold shoes. They are beautiful. So this is pretty much the look. Make sure y'all follow me on Instagram, follow me on Snapchat if you guys would like to see more pictures of me and to follow me sis so let me take my picture so i can head on out oh and i just forgot to spray my perfume so my perfume i'm gonna start telling y'all the perfume that i wear too perfume that i'm wearing is jimmy choo by jimmy choo so let me take my picture so i can go good morning you guys so today i have a super busy day um right now i'm actually headed to the school so that i can pick up the rest of my belongings and i can pick up my ipad as well as my um laptop and then I also have to turn in the keys. Um, so I'm going to be saying goodbye to this school, you guys. Um, I'll be moving on to another school. But like I told you guys, we will be doing um, school um, virtually. So anyways, today is Monday. So happy Monday, you guys. Um, I just wanted to come on here um, to tell you guys. I'll be sure to leave a screenshot after I um, say what I have to say. If I remember, I'll insert it into this vlog. Oh my God, my hands are so ashy and so dry. Um, but this morning, you guys, my Bible was about um, persevering so that you can get what God, um, everything that God has promised to you. 
so it's impo so important to persevere so you guys i feel like i always ask god to speak to me through his word so whether that's um watching a spiritual um video such as td j's joel osteen or any other um pastor or bishop and then um i also ask god to speak to me through his word i'm sorry y'all this road is kind of bumpy um, so yeah, when I'm reading my devotion, that means when I'm reading my Bible, I always ask God to speak to me. So lately I have been really wanting to do some things, you guys, but I have really been letting fear take the best of me. Um, and I know that's not what God wants for me. God wants me to persevere. God wants you to persevere, sis. And God does not want us to live in fear. And I feel like if I'm living in fear and if I'm fearless of even trying things, I've already failed. So, um, I've also been talking to a mentor coach, you guys, and I've also been, um, I'm also doing something, um, it is working for myself, so I'm super excited about that, you guys, um, and I'll probably let you guys know exactly what that is in my next vlog, but y'all, I am just so, um, happy, I'm trying to turn my fear into faith, you guys, it's not gonna happen overnight, um, and sometimes I even have thoughts now, like, oh my god, well, what if it doesn't work? And that's okay. That's okay. Sometimes you got to switch up some things. Sometimes you got to change some things. And just because something doesn't work for you right when you want it to work, you guys, that's not a bad thing. God's timing is just everything. And not only God's timing, it's sometimes you need to switch something up, do something different. And it's not that something's not meant for you. Sometimes it's that you're not trying hard enough. And sometimes if you want it, you literally have to go and get it and my um devotion was about sometimes you literally have to kick the door down like if you feel like you know is this something that you're doing and it's not going the way that you would envisioned it or something like go harder sis go harder go home and um that's what i got from my message today like just persevere sis keep going whatever it is you're going through is going to get better keep going keep pushing and God is going to give you everything he promised, everything you asked for, everything you manifest, um, everything. He's going to give you everything, everything that you're supposed to have. I don't know about y'all, but I want God to be able to say, well done. You did exactly what you were supposed to do while you were on this earth and you fulfilled your purpose. And I feel like right now, you guys, that's the main thing that I've been manifesting is just my, my purpose in life. Um, and not necessarily um, just my career, but just my purpose, just what I'm supposed to be doing, where I'm supposed to be, um, inspiring people, motivating people, telling people about God and um, all of that. You know, like I love to have good energy, positivity is everything to me, you guys. So, yeah, um, I'm getting ready to go into school, you guys. I'm actually waiting on my um, my old assistant from this past year to get here um so that she can um help me get some of this stuff out the classroom and she can um uh give me some of the other stuff i think i'm gonna go ahead, go ahead and go in y'all i'm so thirsty like i have not had nothing to eat or drink this morning it is 8 30 this is the earliest i have been up all summer sis all summer i gotta get used to this sis and then I'm gonna have to get up early to make sure that I'm teaching the kids and everything, you guys. So, woo! And I have YouTube, and I have my vlogs. But vlogging is like my less stressor. Like vlogging is so easy, and it it really I love vlogging. I really do. I really love vlogging. Um, this is like the less stressful part of my life. Vlogging, like when I'm not working, I'm just showing you guys what I'm doing. We chilling. We just be chilling, sis. So yeah, let me get my butt out this car. So you guys, I finally made it home. Y'all, I am in my lounge clothes and everything. Um, I've been working, y'all. I've been editing the video. I'm about to get ready to look at my travel plans that my sister has prepared for us to go to the beach, I think. I'm about to get ready to look at some more beers and stuff, you guys. I am just super excited, you guys, because like I was just in here while I'm cooking, you guys, like giving myself a little pep talk. The other day, you guys, I was just telling God that I'm ready. Like, sis is ready. You know? And if you scared, say you scared. And I was just like, God, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready for the next chapter in my life. I'm ready for the next career move in my life. I'm ready for the next move in my life. I'm ready for whatever you have for me coming. Because I feel it coming. And it's going to be real good. So I'm like, all right now. You said you was ready. 
and y'all i just checked my email and i got an amazing opportunity you guys so i just told god i was ready yesterday and he giving it to me sis he's giving it to me i'm telling you when you speak stuff when you speak things sis you got to be ready because i told him yesterday i'm ready i am ready god i am ready super ready it's about to rain sis and i'm not talking about the thunderstorm i'm talking about rainbows and sunshines after the rain sis that's what i'm talking about it's getting ready to rain in your life sis god is getting ready to do some things so get ready and be ready because you better be ready because you don't want to miss it and if you're scared to say you're scared i'm telling y'all god is so amazing oh my god god is so amazing y'all so i just um i'm cooking right now y'all and i cook all this food and my nephew and case and i gone they gone back to my sister house they were over here but they gone again y'all so now i was like mama do you want this food y'all i'm cooking and i do not want chicken like i had um wings from the wing place that i tell you guys i like and y'all i just don't want chicken i don't cook this food and don't even want it like and i don't want to be wasteful because i i'm not wasteful but y'all i i'm sweating not eating this food y'all i i had baked chicken um i'm waiting for the green beans to be finished now and then i'm getting ready to put this rice on y'all i like i feel like i cannot cook worth the worth the nothing it's just not my thing like lord please bless me with the husband that can cook sis because i hate it here like i'm miserable <laughs> so y'all i am sitting here on my phone distracted because i need to be doing what i just told you guys i should be doing but y'all i um one of my facebook friends was like i just put on there like i give up like cooking i just cannot cook i give up and like somebody was like um this girl i know she was like um she said maybe your next youtube video can be you taking a cooking class or having a private chef which is a really great idea but i don't know if i would really learn from a private chef you know i would just kind of sit on the sofa and let them do their thing you know um, that's kind of what I'm used to. I am spoiled when it comes to cooking, y'all. Like, my mom cooked for me. Like, all my boyfriends I've had, you guys, they were the cooks. Like, they cooked for me. Because I'm the queen, sis. And that's just on period. But no, for real. Like, they cook for me. And I just... Y'all, I be trying. And then, like, it be so funny because Casey be like, Mama, this burnt. And I be like, no, it's not burnt. I be like, eat it. <laughs> y'all y'all pray for me please you know what i need to write that down and i need to write that down tonight i need me a husband that can cook speak that thing into existence sis because i don't know what's going on i'm trying to see what i want i really want some molds y'all but i don't even know if they're open it's like eight o'clock at night it's really too late well not really because i really do need to eat some dinner let me see what time they close i have so much to do i have two more things to do and i haven't even started and it's already 8 o'clock. And I have to get up early tomorrow. I want to at least try to get up by. I got up 8 o'clock this morning. So I probably want to try to get up like at no later than 9 or 10. And then I have a haircut appointment tomorrow, you guys. So I'm going to be rocking my real hair for a minute. I'm going to miss this weave. Like, I'm going to miss this weave. I like the curly weave, the straight weave. All of it, sis. All of it. They close at 9. And I don't want to get sloppy seconds, you know. I'm gonna have to find something else. Good morning, you guys. So I know I probably look kind of crazy and I'm rocking some red hair. I'm actually waiting on my other wigs to dry, but I think I'm gonna wear this one when we go to the beach this weekend. So you guys, I just got back home. I have been running like a freaking chicken all day. Um, I have had conference calls all day. It's probably only like a 10 o'clock. I got up super early this morning um, because uh, my sister, she actually went to go pick up Kaysen's packet um, for his online learning. And um, I dropped them both off to my mom's house because I had them for like the past two days. Y'all, we have been having a blast, but I have also been super busy too uh, with some things that I have going on, including my job. Y'all probably hear that in the background because I'm actually on a conference call right now. So um, yeah, I've had a lot going on, um, trying to make sure I stay on my YouTube schedule, on my work schedule, like my teaching schedule, and also an upcoming business that I have coming and I'm gonna tell you guys probably about um, in my next vlog. So I just finished grocery shopping you guys and this is everything that I got. 
I'm gonna go ahead and unbag it so I can actually show you guys what I got. I actually got enough food for me and Kaysen. Um, I hope I did. Y'all, I'm no cook. Y'all know I'm no cook. So, um, I do have to go back to the store and get like some meat and stuff like that for us to have. But I did grab some ground beef because I like Walmart's beef. Um, but yeah, like, um, this, that's what I was saying. So, we are going to be um, at home because I'm going to be teaching from home and teaching him from home. Which means that we are going to have to um, have lunch. And I'm going to be able to have to cook and prepare lunch. So I got enough groceries um, because school actually starts Monday. And I know with me going out of town, I'm not going to have time to go to the store when I come back and all of that. So I went ahead and did what I need to do. So I'm going to show you guys what I got real quick so I can hurry put this stuff up because it's super hot and I don't want anything to melt. So I'll be right back. So first thing first, you guys already know I got some wine. So this time I got Stella Rose Red. And then I got the Sutter Home Pink Moscato. I tried this one, but it's been such a long time ago. So I hope I still like it. I might pop that open tonight. Or maybe this one, because we're going to do um, burgers or eat the tacos. Then I got some bread. I always get this small loaf, you guys, because I always show y'all. I am so wasteful. It's not intentionally, but y'all, like, I just don't eat a whole lot of bread. And when I do want sandwiches, I go to Subway. So, yeah. I got this because I got some um, red hots. And then I also am going to have my burger on this bread instead of being wasteful and buying hamburger buns. Because it's just me that's going to eat the burger. And I'll probably toast it, you know, make it all fancy and stuff, sis. And then I got some hot dog buns um, for when we have hot dogs maybe one day for lunch. And then I got a bag of chips. I didn't take them out because I normally just throw them in this little um, basket that I have in my pantry. And then coming over here, you guys, let's start on this side. I just got some romaine lettuce this time. I didn't get the mix because I feel like I can um, cut this up, use this for tacos, use this for burgers, eat it as a salad, um, and put like uh, cheese, croutons, whatever else I want to use in it. Um, I got some more pineapples. These are the slices. I got some more salsa, um, more hot sauce. I dropped mine on the floor, you guys, and it bust wide open. Um, I got ruffles, um, I got sweet relish because I am going to be making some more um, tuna probably one day next week um, for us to have for lunch. I got pepper and then I got some tuna right here. I got the seasoned french fries that I normally always get. I got us some more fish because we always eat fish. I tried these things you guys because they were only a dollar and who doesn't like mozzarella sticks right? So this time I got the Yo Plate Smooth Style. I only like the Smooth Style, do not like the fruit in mine. And this one comes with eight. Um, oh wow, no, it comes with sixteen. So hopefully Kaysen can help me eat this up. It is the strawberry and vanilla one. They also had like a blueberry and a um, a strawberry banana, but it was kind of like open on one side. And I was like, nah, sis, we're not even gonna try it. I got some um, vanilla ice cream. Um, I got some drumsticks because we like that. And then I got some um, cranberry apple. I got some macaroni and cheese. I got fruit roll-ups. I got Kool-Aid jammers. I got the strawberry kiwi. Haven't had this flavor in a long time. I got Capri Sun. Kaysen loves Pop-Tarts. So I got him brown sugar and strawberry. Oh. Okay, I also got some grease. We just got orange juice, milk. I always get small things, you guys, because I'm trying not to be wasteful. I got the Tropical Punch. I got a few Power Raids. Um, I got Hot Wings because Kaysen loves Hot Wings, you guys. He has them at my dad's house all the time. I got Dip. I got Sour Cream. I got some more dishwashing liquid, cinnamon rolls, ground beef, the Red Hots I was telling you guys about. Another pack of ground beef. This is a package. Um, bacon, the Red Baron pieces that he liked. And I got the steak fries because I wanted to try something different. Picked up a lemonade. And then I got the Cheez-Its and also some fruits and oh, vegetables. What's up, my loves? So today is Thursday. So you guys, I just finished filming um, two videos, you guys, because I realized that I was so far behind on my filming schedule because I was so busy trying to get my stuff ready for school. And I was so busy trying to... Um, get some other stuff that I was telling you guys about that I'm working on done. Let me cut this light on so y'all can kind of see me. So yeah, um, right now I'm packing because I am going to the beach tomorrow. So I'm going ahead and packing my stuff. I'm getting all like my beauty stuff and my toiletries and stuff so we can get ready to go. Uh, we can be out tomorrow. Boom, boom, hey! Oh boy. 
He like, he was waiting for me to put him on the camera to do that, y'all. Y'all already know. He love his handshake. Oh, let me get my, um, my luggage out of here, too. But, yeah, y'all. So, um, I've actually slacked a little bit on my filming schedule. Oops. I actually should film some more videos. Um, but honestly, you guys, I really haven't been wanting to film because I really like filming, um, with my... Uh, short haircut, but y'all know how I told y'all I was going to get a haircut. My hairstyle is actually cut it too short. Y'all, I was so, like, I have been so busy. I have been on conference calls, and she was cutting my hair, and I was trying to listen, but I wasn't really worried, and it's just too short, sis. So, I can't hold up my content just because my hair is too short. Like, we're not doing that. You know what I mean? We're not doing that. I'm like, now you're just making excuses, sis. We're trying to glow, and we're trying to grow. Because I was about to say that I am just going to do vlogs for now. Um, and then do makeup videos here and there. since um, Because school started back. Which is crazy because normally I would do just um, beauty videos and not vlog. But I mean why not? I'm going to be here at home. So you know. Might as well. So yeah. That's what I'm doing. I'm actually packing up my stuff now. Um, what is on my face is what I'm taking on vacation. We're only going to be gone Friday through Sunday. Um, and my skin is really crazy, so I kind of do need some makeup. Oh, I look good. Yes, sis. Um, my face looks so matte, and I love it. Um, this is just a beach makeup look that I filmed. You guys will see this video, um, on Tuesday. So, yeah. Um, that's pretty much what I'm doing right now, you guys. Casey and I are going to get some uh, dinner in a minute. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to come on here. Um, say what's up because I'm actually getting ready to end the vlog um, because I'm starting a new vlog since we're going out of town so that's going to be super exciting and super fun so yeah um, that is pretty much it for this vlog y'all stay tuned for more if you like the vlogs go ahead and give me a big thumbs up and smash that subscribe button and I will see you guys in Florida